All right, my five signs. Hey, hey, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Welcome back. Sun, Moon, Rising, Mars, Mercury, Venus. Mars, Mercury, Venus, North Node, Pluto, <laughs> Unicorn, whatever place that you got fire sign in your chart. All right, so let's get it started. Like, share, subscribe, turn on notifications so you be notified of my videos daily. And we're going to get into it. All right, I know y'all like, damn, why I don't see her face? Okay, we should switch things up. Just listen to these messages. Okay, March 4th through 6th, we're going to get into it. Thank you, boo. But, um, yeah, so just intuitively what I'm getting is, um, your emotions. So your emotions, you could be very, like, very chill this weekend. A lot of you guys can be working on either your finances. This can also be, this can be food, like diet, exercise here. This can be planning, like meal plan or planning strategies here. This can be um how you wanting to execute something, want to execute like a craft, a hobby, okay, a talent. I'm also getting you guys can be wanting to study or it's a need for you guys to study or research something in order for you to get into it. I'm also getting there's a need for you not to buy something big or waste your money on something big, um, like miscellaneous, miscellaneous here. I'm also getting a lot of you guys can be wanting to get spiritual healing, spiritual healing, like baths or readings or um, clarity, okay, is also what I'm hearing. I'm also getting a lot of shifts when it comes to, like, your money management or your money, your time, your effort, your schedule, like, your routine. A lot of great things can also be popping off, but I'm also getting, like, um, supernatural plot twists. I'm also hearing numbers, okay? I'm also, I'm also hearing... Um, Someone's palm can be itching. Someone's palm can be itching today. And I feel like you could be winning the lottery today for somebody. Um, I definitely feel like you guys can be decorating or wanting to decorate or enhance. This can be enhance yourself. This can be decorating your house, your car. Um, I feel like a lot of you guys also can be spending a lot of time with family. I'm also getting children or legacy is also on your brain. The mind, so the mind, this can be like the mind, how you think, how others think. Or maybe it's like you're reading something or you're looking at something nonstop. I'm like referring to somebody looking at somebody's phone. Maybe someone is looking at your picture, wanting to text you as well or call. I'm also getting you or someone else can be writing a text message and deleting it. Um, like they wanting to text or they're wanting to call and say something to you, but they're not is what I'm hearing. I'm also getting someone's definitely feeling guilty or remorseful for how they treated you, left you on the cold um, or what they've said. Friend, family, lover, whomever okay they're just regretting something i'm also gonna just expect somebody to really be trying to put a smile on your face but i feel like you're already set into like i feel like just need for you to go with your first mind like go with your first mind with something i'm also getting someone can be trying to trick you or maybe someone is in a relationship already and wanting to get out of the relationship but i'm also getting uh someone has their heart in two places here so you could be in a relationship or married but you could be in love with somebody else or you could be single and dating and having a lot of options here. And this can be a lot of people trying to get your attention, wanting to be with you. And you're having to decide, okay, who do I want to be with? Uh, I don't know. You know, like maybe you're trying to figure out who, who you want to be with, okay? Yeah. And then I feel like others of you, you're just celibate. You're just single, chilling, doing what you got to do, taking care of your family. Um, You probably do want love, but I do feel like that group of people the group of people that's really not looking for love you're really focused on your money or you're put, getting your finances in order getting things checked off um looking at where you can put a b and c is also what i'm hearing all right aries leo sagittarius collectively okay some of you guys can also be saving money for a um i'm getting luxury item epiphany so your dreams your dreams and downloads your angels okay your dreams and downloads can be coming to you quick quickly like i just definitely feel like my intuition has been on point okay i am a fire sign i just feel like this definitely is is the energy that i'm in like really um sensitive during this time but very alert right like listening to my um intuition allowing my guides my ancestors my angels to guide me god to guide me okay i definitely feel like it's like i'm also growing when i'm also growing like i'm a, like okay 
spiritual people are spiritual people healers okay we're light be light beings right so it's like we're light to others like we we show the way we show the path right so i definitely feel like this is the um this is like a yes okay this is like um, like I finally, I finally made it. I'm almost there. This is like the ancestors, gra like congratulating you, like you're going to the next level. You did, you did what you're supposed to do. Okay, I'm also thinking you're listening to meditations or binaural beats here, music. Your chakras are clearing, or you could be needing to heal or cleanse your chakras, a spiritual bath. I'm also getting um. elder you could be talking to an elder or spending time with family that are older than you is what i'm hearing okay so this is just a confirmation for me so i feel like if you're watching this i feel like you guys can be having some type of supernatural um things that are happening this weekend i feel like you're also realizing um that you're on the right track or you're 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 needing to you're on the right track you're needing to still heal it's okay for you to cry it's okay for you to laugh okay um you're taking the right steps you also what I'm hearing um you guys can also be just feeling very very glad like it's like it's like you're not like in the woe is me here okay for some of you you guys can also be getting a reading with me and maybe maybe I'm revealing to you some type of epiphanies or revealing to you some type of aha moments as well. That's also what I'm seeing. Okay. So recovery, okay, like I said, getting over something, not talking to people, okay. I feel like you're you're realizing that if things were not just for you, you're not dealing with it, okay? You're really focused on putting your time and energy into yourself here. You don't want to deal with any relationships at this time. I do feel like if offers are coming towards you, you are saying no. You're putting your time and energy into your money, your finances, okay? You're realizing that things may be repeating because it's like you have to change up the people around you, your environment, your social groups here, or this is a lot of people involved in a situation you may be very closely connected with somebody as well but you're like you whether this is a family a friend a lover i feel like there's not a lot of love here maybe you guys are not on the same frequency vibration okay i do feel like um there may be a situation as well where you may be involved with um a whole bunch of communication with a lot of people this can be a gossip or a lot of people trying to put in their two cents or you may be in a friend group or community where there's a lot of people involved okay i do feel like a situation where you guys um if you guys are involved with like uh tormenting or gang gang stalking or talking shit about somebody slandering somebody i feel like you guys are walking watching somebody work work hard like i feel like somebody's trying to say like oh somebody's uh like crazy or somebody's like like not who they say they are but i feel like fire sign if you're saying this about if you're saying this about another fire sign, like specifically somebody who you know is like, like I feel like fire sign, you're you're in a you're in a group of friends or whatever the case may be talking about somebody, but you're watching somebody like work hard or do A, B, and C, and I feel like. Maybe you, you and these people were trying to talk shit about this person's work ethic or their money or whatever. But I feel like these like you and these people don't even know how much money this person making. Or maybe that's the truth. Like, it's like y'all talking shit because y'all don't really know nothing about this person. Y'all don't have access to this person. Somebody's blocked. You guys are blocked or you guys don't have access. It's like y'all can watch somebody stalk somebody all day. But energetically, like emotionally, y'all don't have access to this person. So this can be... Uh, what I'm telling you so this can be an aha like oh shit or it's like maybe you guys were caught or found out or maybe this is just what you're realizing okay I'm also getting like I said healing recovery okay you're not why you're not dealing with something anymore dealing with somebody anymore okay I feel like you guys feel like there's imbalance like people are not truthful here okay I feel like you guys are really just focused on your your family your your children your brand okay I do feel like 
um, you are in some type of waiting period. I feel like something's like gradually coming in the will of fortune. It's like something's happening, uh, happening towards Saturday, Sunday is what I'm hearing. I feel like you're getting out of your head. You're you're right where you need to be. The will of fortune and the world card is your time. I'm also getting success. Okay, world renowned, worldwide web. Okay, peace transform, transform transformation. Okay, maturity growth stability okay but i'm also getting you're you're doing things that are making you happy here and in turn you're being peaceful you're at peace with self i'm also getting people can just be feeling threatened around you like people that you are not dealing with like they're not they're they're upset because you're at peace or you're happy here things are going right in your life is what i'm hearing so i feel like and this is definitely if you have um Like, Leo, I feel like you guys can definitely be going through some type of, like, it's like you're going through something over and over. Because it, the Six of Wands and the Sun reverse, okay, followed by the Emperor came out in, in, on top of the Wheel of Fortune. So, I feel like there's some type of cycle that you guys are unhappy with that has to do with, like, a masculine energy or has to do with you having to have control or trying to control someone or something to do with, like, sex, okay, or, like, your passion, what you want, your talent here. I'm also getting, um, yeah, you guys can be feeling, some of you guys, I feel like you've been doing something for the past 12 months or one to two years here, and I feel like it's, something's happening where... Yeah, I feel like something's happening where now you may have manifested something new when it comes to like money or, okay, specifically Leo's, okay? You guys can be going through a situation where you're unhappy with something because you took a risk, like a new relationship, a new situation, a new craft or doing something, and now you're stuck into something because it's like you're tied to the devil, you, your heart or something is, it wasn't in the right place. And so now emotionally, spiritually, you're like tired or doing something over and over or overly in excess now okay and now you're just exhausted tired okay and i feel like it's because you aren't being honest with yourself or you were doing some type of magic when it came to like i said the spiritual person is to card reader or whomever or whoever you were friends with or whatever the case may be okay if that's not your story leo then if you are a fire sign i definitely feel like you guys um if you're if that's not your story, Leo, I definitely feel like you guys just be you guys are just unhappy and exhausted from work, from having to do something over and over. And it's like you guys may have been waiting for a response to something new with a new job or starting. It's like you wanted something new to start, but it didn't happen. Okay, like I said, your manifestation skills, your spell work, something that you were speaking out. It's like you wasn't doing it right here. Yeah, it's like you're not listening to me. It's not, it's not, it's not, you're not listening to your higher self because the high priest is in reverse. So this can be a tarot card reader or advice that you're giving that you're like, no, this is not for me. Like, you know, Leo, like you can be listening to, to this, like, no, this is not me. This is not me. Or you could be so, you could be so like steady into wrapped up into what type of magic or spell work that you may have been doing the past year, two years or whatever, that you're not realizing that you're actually, um, like tiring yourself out here okay keeping yourself stuck and indecisive and i'm also getting it's like maybe you keep doing some type of love magic or something but it's like you keep running into dudes or got girls that are indecisive or that are trying to take take from you is what i'm getting or this is what you're doing to them okay fire sign i definitely feel like you guys are moving forward Okay, I definitely feel like during this weekend, you guys are definitely going to be listening to your um, your nudges here. The moon card, that's like becoming more, uh, more feminine, more happy, right? More like emotionally sensitive, more in tune with your feminine side. So you guys can definitely be taking a lot more naps or resting a lot. Like I said, up, um, up late at night, like getting some type of divine downloads, connecting more with your guides and your ancestors, God, right? Like getting, getting ready. I'm getting, I'm also getting like they're prepping you, they're prepping you, they're prepping you, they're getting you ready. Okay, I'm also getting you didn't go through all this bullshit, especially if you are a Sagittarius or an Aries when it came to a Leo and a Leo, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Gemini, whomever that was doing whatever to you, specifically Sagittarius and Aries, you're about to blow the fuck up and these people are going to watch you. Uh, 
um in the dust i'm also gonna you can have oh so you can have an aries north node so you can have an aries north node is what i'm getting aries north north node sagittarius moon that's specific sagittarius moon aries north node or aries south node thank you spirit thank you spirit aries south node sagittarius moon if you are an aries south node sagittarius moon people are going to be very um surprised or you could be very surprised at like how far you've gone or you could be looking at how far you've gone and you could be having some type of happy tears or it's like you're just reviewing, reviewing your life okay and i feel like you're you're really feeling at peace like there's a lot of gratefulness acceptance as well as also what i'm hearing fire sign okay so it's not just Sagittarius Aries, it's just all fire signs. Just maybe you guys are just realizing what is needed and what's not. Alrighty? So peace, love, and light.